Okay, guys, I hope you guys are all being blessed today. I hope that everyone is out of harm's way. These baby powder um, insatiations or whatever. Um, you can order these from me. I got a shipment like I got a lot of stuff that's coming in. I got different packs or whatever, but around here where I live at, I like, I like sell them or whatever to people. Um, you can um, purchase them for me for $3 and 50 cents. Um, all you have to do is email me at peachpaller at gmail.com. These, these are my favorite. I got, I'm going to show y'all everything. I'm going to bring out everything that I have and I'm going to show it to you guys for you guys to start ordering with me or whatever. This is my favorite and these, um, they have their guaranteed, uh, fragrance when they last a long time or whatever and like they have a different essential oils and uh herbs in them so ascension oils and herbs so you know you and it's different flavors or whatever but we're not going to talk about that right now we're going to do this over here a reading but um yeah i have those i'm gonna have because i ordered um because I use them myself. I use them all up. So I was like, you know, it's a lot of people, like different stuff that I buy around here where I live at. They be liking stuff that I be doing and things that I be having and different things. And, you know, they ask me where I get it at or they ask me this or that or whatever. So, you know, if I know that, you know, it's a lot of people like and you know, and most of the time they be. It's not over here. It's not any. Um, most of the time, oh God, okay, oh. so we gonna put that right there because it's going to purify some stuff here as well. And we need that. We need that for the atmosphere. Do you hear me? So. I usually order stuff in big bulks, big quantities. And me and my daughter. <laughs> We just like separate it and we share it and I take half and she get half. But like I noticed whatever, even things that I have her using, they're starting to hit her up on her Snapchat and they want some. So I just thought that it would be good to go ahead and bring it over here with y'all too. Um... Because again, I say these, they purifies the atmosphere, energy, frankincense, angelic frankincense. So this, this is another way for me to purify my space here. Okay, so 
We're going to do a reading here. Father God, I pray and hope that everyone is safe and out of harm's way. We just ask you to come in and take over our beings, Lord God. Anything that's unlike you, remove it in the mighty name of Jesus. We just ask you to be with us and to protect us and guide us and lead us out of any uh, danger or out of harm's way. We ask you to take all of our traumas in the mighty name of Jesus and Kill them off in the mighty name of Jesus. Let us receive nothing but healing in the mighty name of Jesus. And we just thank you, Lord. Okay, so I am going to put in the description box, though, in regarding to my cards that I'm starting to make. You can get your own deck made um, with your own picture on them. You can get 55. Uh, I mean, you can get... 60 to 80 cards here. Um, it will be $55 depending. It may be 60 or whatever um, if I give you the 80 card deck. But, um, and also you can come get a reading with me and learn how to start clearing ancestral uh, curses. that was brought in from our ancestors. So, Father God, if you could just come in in the mighty name of Jesus. I got so many more cards that go with this deck right here. And this this deck, I'm going to put it in the bottom of the description box on this reading. This deck is um, the two real deck. The two real oracle deck. So, you know y'all be real up in here. I know it's a bunch of real ass niggas on here. So, not, well, I'm not going to say niggas because they starting to take that word just out of content. Like, out of, it's not being used in a good way. And I know how that feels because I've been called that before. So, okay. And being that the cards are kind of big or whatever, uh, what I do is shuffle them up, down, up, and they come out just fine. Um, you could get your day um, regarding the karmics, regarding the divine masculine, uh, regarding things to do with yourself, things to do with your work life, things to do with your home life, thing that, things that you need to be doing for yourself. And it will go more in depth or of the message will be like clarity or whatever. So guys, come order with me. Um, it's 60 cards, 60 to 80 cards, 55 to $60. Um, you email me at peachparlor at gmail.com and you send me your picture and you can get different pictures put on your Oracle deck. Or you could just get one particular picture. And um, this guy still haven't got back with me, but he print the messages on the back of the card. So I've been waiting on him to get back with me. But get your own. Like, these are so neat. I think this is so cool. <laughs> so... Okay, we're going to just take this five here. Okay, so this is, I want to have sex with you and I have someone else, but I want it for one night. Someone want to have sex with you and they only want it for one night or whatever, um, but they like, they're in a relationship. So I don't know who that is, but you will know who that is. <clears throat> Someone has a crush on you. It's a Scorpio. Someone have a crush on you. It's a Scorpio. A, Aqu a Aquarius has a crush on you. 
These cards fell out last night. So somebody really, Queen of Swords, somebody is really a popular entitled female is lying, hating, jealous, and stalking you, Divine Feminine. So it's a popular, whoever this girl is, she's popular. So y'all know who y'all dealing with. <laughs> Female is lying, hating, jealous, and stalking you, Divine Film. So, this girl is popular. So, that meaning, it must be uh, quite a few people know this gal. Do you hear me? But anyway, we gonna get these. We gonna get some more clarity on it. Because quit following me. Because you lying anyways. So, so someone is popular. They could have a great big following. They feel entitled. They're stalking. They're lying. They're jealous. Did it say they're jealous? Yep. Hating, jealous, stalking you, divine feminine. So... Who is one to have sex with you? Four of Cups. This is a water sign that maybe you feel that have been indifferent with you in the past. They did something indifferent to you in the past. They got someone else. They're in a relationship. It's being indifferent for them to come towards you. But all they know is they want to have sex. And they know that for sure. Um, that they want to have sex. They Things are going indifferent for them. They don't know how they're going to get to the bottom of this or get to do this. Because they know that they're in a relationship. But they want to have sex with you if they don't want to do anything else. It's indifferent with them. They could be coming back towards you because they don't care what. They're attracted to you and they want to have sex with you. And this card right here that's a little bit more provocative with boobs showing here. Um, it's right next to it. So that could be a sign that this person is very attracted to you. They want to do the nasties with you they look at you and want ooh, wait a minute lovers this could be an air sign but someone has a crush on you and it's a Scorpio this person sees you as their lover and they could want to commit or want a commitment with you or you could have been in a commitment with this person in the past it's a, some type of air sign and it could be a man or a woman it doesn't matter um, that's just what it's saying, or uh, whatever, um, this person, um, angel of commitment, they want, maybe they was non-committal before, maybe they were with this person that they're with right now, and they don't know how to leave this person to be with you, but right now they are it's all up in their stomach in their guts in their mind they want some sex and they want it from you they want it and they want it right now a aquarius has a crush on you it is a aquarius around you somewhere and they got a crush on you in your community this could be on the internet they are silently watching you and following you and um, this could be King of Wands. They got passion for you, or whatever. This is a passionate leader of somehow could be. They do some work on the internet. They're around in your community. Could be around where you live at. This is a King of Wands. He is passionate about trying. He is passionate about crushing on you right now. He's got a lot of flames firing all up, or whatever. He said it's getting hot in here. So take off all your clothes. Woo! What? This man or whatever. It's Aquarius. And 
They could be in a leadership position. They could be an entrepreneur. They could be a businessman, a clergyman, a teacher, a preacher, a lawyer, a doctor. I don't know, but they're a leader in t -way. And they're a passionate king about whatever work they do, but they're passionate about having a crush on you. Okay? Okay. I, I, I. Who is this right here? Queen of Swords. Air signs. Are you the one that's keeping up all of this? Jabber, jabber, jabber. Air signs. This is a, just a reading. But it's air and water and fire. Earth, water, and fire. Queen of Swords. So whoever this Queen of Swords is, you are Six of Wands. You are starting to recognize whatever your power. And Seven of Pentacles, you're visualizing, you know, how much that, you know, work you have done to do with self. You are more focused on, you know, accumulating more uh, wealth for longevity for yourself. You are in recognition that, you know, you got to put yourself first because no one else is going to do that. Seven of Pentacles, you're more focused on to do with self and, you know, things that will make you happy, things that will bring you prosperity, things that will get you from being stuck, things that, you know, because you're the empress, the empress, angel of abundance or whatever, you're going to be abundant. You could be a mother. You, you, you know how to manifest things like plant, you know how to plant, grow and reap the harvest. You hold the light to a lot of things that, you know, to get you abundance or whatever, you could, like, someone could want to get you pregnant or, again, I say you just could be a mother or you could be birthing something new, a new idea that you're, you know, the light is going to be shined on. Night of Wands, you could be, uh, like, taking action on whatever job this is, whatever to do with your abundance for self or whatever you're in recognition that, you got to love yourself. You got to do this for yourself. You can't let people, even friends or whatever, hold you back from doing what you need to do for you. You got to be about you. You can't give it to other people. That in this season is what I'm hearing is a time like you have never been selfish before. You need to focus on whatever that new idea is, that new job, that new business that new creative, uh, you know, uh, endeavor that you've been wanting to bark up on. I, like, you need to focus on whatever it is that you're trying to do to get yourself out of being in a...